Now, if you have a large family and want to carry seven people across the country, what would you choose? A crossover like the Arya or an SUV like the Ford Endeavor? We'll help you choose in this comparison. First, let's take a look at how these two handle on the road. The Tata Aria Pride 4x4 has an on-demand all-wheel drive system that is best suited for tarmac. Of course, it can be called upon to do mild off-road duties, but it does not have enough ground clearance and it has too many overhangs which can get knocked about. But on tarmac, the Aria handles pretty well. It comes with an electronic stability program that ensures you keep all four wheels on the road at all times. The Aria is powered by a 2.2-litre diesel engine that puts out 138 bhp of power and 320 newton meters of torque through a 5-speed manual transmission. The engine is pretty refined and features such as cruise control make long trips really easy. The Ford Endeavor 4x4 on the other hand is a rugged SUV with huge ground clearance and even more space. It comes with a part-time 4-wheel drive system and limited slip differential that is great for hardcore off-road duties. It has an old-school leaf spring suspension setup that can take quite a beating, but on tarmac, the Endeavour is a bit bouncy. The Endeavour's 3-litre diesel engine puts out 154 bhp of power and 380 Nm of torque and is mated to a 5-speed automatic transmission. This makes driving the Endeavour in city traffic or on the highway really easy. But when it comes to comfort, the Aria is better. It has better designed seats and features such as automatic climate control. The Endeavour's high flow makes long trips for rear passengers rather uncomfortable. The Aria also boasts of more comfort and safety features such as six airbags, all-round disc brakes, steering audio controls, etc. The Endeavour does not have as many features. However, the clincher is when it comes to price. The Endeavour 4x4 Automatic costs over 20 lakh rupees ex showroom, while the Aria costs only about 16 lakhs. So, if you think practically, the Aria is a better bet when it comes to comfortable travel for 7 people with a bit of luggage. But when you are shelling out that kind of money, you would also be looking at image value. And that's where the Endeavour steals the show. The Butch SUV looks are a definite head turner compared to the bland van like look of the Aria. The question is, can you really put a prize on vanity?